Hi guys, it's Jessica Seinfeld. I am very excited to make my current obsession with you today, quinoa chips. They are so easy, they bake in 30 minutes, and they will be gone in less than 30 seconds in your house. That's what happens at mine. First thing we're gonna do is put our oven to 300, and we're gonna move our racks to the middle of the oven. Now we're on to our ingredients. I'm using brown rice flour, half a cup, a great gluten-free alternative. Next, we're using quinoa flour. Great gluten-free alternative as well. Quarter cup. We're gonna put a pinch of salt. Two tablespoons of your favorite olive oil. And a half a cup of water. Very simple. We're gonna stir it till it's smooth. It kind of resembles pancake batter. I feel like this is a little thick. So I'm gonna add a little bit of water, tiny amount, sparingly as you go. Next, spray your sheet pan with your favorite cooking spray. Measure out a half a tablespoon onto your pan because you're gonna get 12 per pan so that this batch yields 36 chips. And the key to this is making sure that they're even. Starting from the outside in and then from the inside out, just smooth them out. Now is the fun part where you put your toppings on. We're gonna to use today black pepper, garlic powder, and a little bit of sea salt. That's the great thing about these. You can really tailor them to what you're into. I make them sweet with cinnamon and sugar and nutmeg. I use poppy seeds and paprika. You can really just freestyle it, whatever you have in your house. Now we're gonna put them in the oven. We're gonna bake them for about 30, 35 minutes until they're golden brown and crispy. You can bake your two or three trays at the same time, whatever you have room for in your oven. And here they are, nice and crisp and golden brown.